What is going on guys? Today I am over at the quarry to try to do some ice fishing on the smaller quarry that is on the, I guess it would be the west side of this area. I'm not really sure. But last time I was out, I made a stupid, stupid decision to hit my auger onto the ice. Um, I'm not sure why I did it, but I did. And the blade busted off, so I have to replace this real quick. And then uh, I'll get over there see if we can find some fish. Let's go! All right, first drop down, um, first video in a while too. I haven't posted anything, and I feel like forever. It can't be the bottom already, is it? We're in like no water then. Nothing lying to me. Come on, fish. First fish of the day. I really, really want to get on a bass today. If I can catch a bass today, that would be sick. That would be sick. Looks like there's some action down there. It's definitely not as deep as I thought it was. So we might have to actually move to a different hole. Right down to the bottom. Reel up just a little bit. There's the first fish of the day, boys. First little gillian of the day. Hey, let's not act crazy. Get him unhooked. You could have that wax worm, I guess. First fish of the day, little bluegill. Nice little little buddy. First fish right there, boys. There you go. Later, dude. He did take my worm, so I have to put another one on. That's good. That took, uh, what, three minutes of recording over there, so. Hopefully there are bass around, though, or bigger, like, bigger sized gills. I want to really get something good today. Let's clean this out a little bit. Try to find the tanks. The jig right about there. Another one. This feels a little bit better. Oh, it came off. That had to have been a bass. Why did I wait so long? Jeez, that was either a bass or a good gill. What the hell? Took my wax worm. All right, that's a good sign at least. That felt like a like some decent weight, and it wasn't like a little nibble like those little uh, little gills usually are. All right, that's mistake number one of the day. Another wax worm on here. Man, that could have been. That's disappointing. Get back down there right away. See if we can find that again. That was, that could have been good. Something's nibbling on it. I just pulled it right out. It's not good. Let's get right back down there. It's gotta be a little gill though. For a bass, it'd probably just slam it and go. That's a bite. A little guy. It looks super cool though. Like, look at his yellow stomach. That's so cool. Some cool looking fish right there. Thanks, buddy. Here we go. There's a fish. The little guy. He's stuck on the deucer. Let's get him off and go back down there. So like I said, there's a lot of fish down there right now. That's like the third fish of the day right there. Oh, go back down. No, go down. There you go. Hopefully they're bigger fish. Like the marks look decent. It's kind of calming down now. Uh oh, something's coming to get it right away. Come on, be a bass. Oh, it's another little gill. All right, let's get him back in. Get right back down there. Thank you, buddy. 
right back down. Here we go. Let's get right by this fish. This fish looks right by four feet. Here he comes to get it. Here he comes. Take it. It's a little guy. Something though. I haven't had a fish in a little while. Thanks, Minnie. I hooked myself. There's another big mark down there. Get down to the bottom and see if I can hook him. He's coming for it. It's probably just a little bluegill that I'm seeing, but it's there. He's there. Might not be very interested in it though. Oh, it's gone. Mark's gone. Could be a better fish. Oh, it's pulling. It's pulling. It's a bass. It's a bass, guys. It's a bass. Keep pressure. Oh no, I'm on the ice. Dude, look at that. It was a bass for sure. It's a bass. Oh! He just broke me off. No! Look at this. <sighs> so as you just saw, um, broken off by what could have been a decent bass, I don't know. He took my Swedish pimple away. Um, but as you guys can see, I haven't been catching much, mostly just little bluegills. Um, yeah, I don't even know what to say. Like I just said before, this sucks. Like that looked like an okay fish. Like, so I think I'm gonna try another, another spoon like this to see if they'll come back for it. That sucks big time. I don't have a lot of line on this rod. Definitely unprepared. He was definitely pulling drag and then uh, just broke me off. So I don't know what, I don't know what to do. Man! It's a crappie. Damn. I will take that. Crappie killer. Should probably take if I find some crappie, take some home because uh well he's not the biggest. Not the biggest crappie, but they do always look super cool. So we got a little bit of a multi-species day going on here. A little crappie. Uh we'll get him going, I guess. They always look super cool. Really cool colors. He's trying to jump out, so thank you, buddy. We'll try to get the Back down there right away. Whoa! Because when well, there's one crappie, there's got to be more, right? That kind of makes up for that last bass, but not really at all, actually. Because that, that really sucked. Like that. That one sucked. Uh oh, here's a fish. There's a decent fish coming. There's a decent fish coming. Come on. Or it could be a school, a crappie or something like that. They're right on my bait, though. It's right there. Come on. Grab the spoon. That one. Oh, this one's pulling good, too. Don't break off. It's a bass. Let's get him out. <laughs> this is what I was hoping for today, boys. Uh-oh, I hooked my pants. Largey through the ice, hooked right at the top of the lip there. Watch that pop out. He was not going anywhere. This guy has the side of his mouth all jacked up. Hell yeah. First uh, little largey through the ice here. You can see on this side of his mouth, it's definitely been caught before. Right there, it's kind of janky. So, I don't know. Hell yeah, multi-species day. Got redemption on this fish. I wonder if this is the one. No, I don't see any Swedish pimples there, so. Thanks, buddy. Hell yeah. Let's get that release on him. Thanks, little dude. There he goes. Back in the hole. Hell yeah. 
That is some redemption right there. I was bummed on uh, that last loss. So far, I've had this little pimple. Actually, this is not even a Swedish pimple. This is something else, like a ripoff. But uh, had him on for a couple minutes now and caught a crappie and a nice little bass. So a little bit of a multi-species day going on here. This might be the juice. This might be the hole right here that I found, which is uh, five feet of water. That fish was looking at my bait for a while and would not commit to it. Looks like he's chilling down by like three feet now. Let's get back down there, see if we can hook something else. All right guys, I'm gonna have to call it for today. It is starting to rain slash snow and I just walked back to my car. So a uh, decent mix of fish today. Not a bad day really. And uh, makes me want to come back here maybe tomorrow or the day after with some live bait and see if I can catch some more fish. So uh, yeah, that's gonna be it for today. I will check you guys in the next video. Later.